In the box of the Mayano Fairy Light AU902, we have a very well packaged bit of kit. We receive a set of earphones, the user manual, a 1 meter USB C cable, and the Mayano Fairy Light. It has an all metal body and measures in at approximately 17 centimeters from the bottom of the base to the top of the mic and 8 centimeters across. The mic itself is approximately 12 centimeters high and five and a half centimeters wide. The bottom has a rubber pad to prevent it from sliding around and it can be removed from the mount by unscrewing the thumb screws on either side. But there is not a hole on the bottom to mount it to an arm. The base does unscrew and there is a mounting hole available if you prefer to have it installed onto an arm. It's best to get in your desired position and then screwing it down once as it's screwed if you begin to move it around this will loosen the screws but once it's screwed in position then you won't have this issue. On the back is the 3.5mm socket for the earphones and the USB-C port and on the front there are two dials which control the volume of the mic and the volume of the earphones if you wish to monitor what you sound like and these rotate fluently with no clicking sounds the top one is also a push button which allows you to mute it if you need to it has a cardiopolar pattern which means that you will need to speak directly into the front for the best sound some sound will get picked up from the sides and reduce sound from the back everything you've heard so far through the review has been directly from the Myano microphone our audio levels are currently set at 100 on the PC and we're on full blast on the microphone as well. As previously mentioned, your best sound is going to come directly through the front of this mic. If we turn it around, you should still be able to hear us, but with less sound and less clarity. So what I think is best to do now is to do a comparison test between this and a couple of other microphones and see how this compares. And this is a test using our Dell G6 laptop inbuilt microphone. Uh, obviously we can't open the lid up because it's gonna block this. This is the money shot. We can't be blocking this. But yeah, that gives you a bit of an idea of what the internal microphone sounds like on a laptop. And this is a test using the Fine Fine K678 microphone. It's very much like the Myano in the fact that you need to speak directly into the front. You get some sound into the sides and reduce sound from the back. We have set the mic levels to 50% on this one because it's very sensitive. And if we do this at 100%, it's just going to blow your ears off. Peter Piper packed a pick of pickle peppers. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickle peppers. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickle peppers. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickle peppers. Approximately two feet away from the microphone, this is the kind of audio you can expect. This is an audio test using the Fine Fine K678. We are roughly around two feet away from the microphone. So the microphone does a pretty good job. If you're using something like an inbuilt microphone on your laptop, this is going to absolutely annihilate that. The audio monitoring performs really well where there's no delay from you speaking to what you can hear through the earphones. It's pretty much the same price as the Fine Fine K678. The Myano is smaller in size, but you do need to be fairly close to it because this is currently maxed out to 100%. But overall Myano, You've done a very good job. Thank you for staying all the way till the end of this review. If you found it useful, feel free to give us a like and a subscribe. You're welcome to share the video with family and friends if you want to. Have yourself a great day. We'll see you in the next one.